If you're female, you might be curious as to whether you can take finasteride or dutasteride to address your hair loss like men do. And the answer is yes. Both premenopausal and postmenopausal women can take these DHT blocks, but I do want to caution you about the following. If you're premenopausal, you have to be very careful to stop the medication six months before a planned pregnancy because there is a risk if you try to get pregnant. But besides that, finasteride and dutasteride are very effective medications to address female hair loss. Wow, so this doctor is definitely a cowboy. <laughs> a the, cowboy. the data in women for finasteride and dutasteride is very sparse. I would really be careful about your reproductive organs, particularly as a woman. And the fact of the matter is we just don't have enough data to really know what the safety profile is of these drugs for women. That said, if you were gonna try a finasteride or dutasteride, I would ideally say a topical, and hopefully that topical would be maximized for getting into the follicular shafts mm -hmm. without being systemically absorbed, where it could cause sort of of the potential side effects. I think Nathan had another point as well. Right, well, you know, even for women, I suppose, the primary mechanism of, of, of hair loss is not really androgen related. For some women, obviously it is, and that's, you know, those are horrible cases. But generally, women who experience hair loss have uh, a lack of sufficient stimulation. And so a dutasteride probably won't help so much in that regard. Finasteride neither. Finasteride won't either, yeah.